Okay, kid, this is it. Just head down that path there to the playground. Kids are expecting you. Have a great field trip. Oh, hey! First time at the park, huh? Cool! You're gonna love this place. Are you shy? Because I promise, all the kids here are really nice. You can just go right up to them, and they'll invite you to play. by any chance want to play cars, would you? Well, you sure came to the right playground. I'm Shelby, and I'm crazy about cars. I love playing Mater. <laughs> he cracks me up. Hey, what if we're at Willie's Butte and Radiator Springs, and Lightning McQueen is looking for a new car in his racing team? That's you. you. But first, you gotta try out. So you're gonna have to pass the Tomator Fancy Driving Challenge. Yep, I designed this course specially so it's only the bestest drivers in the whole world can finish. And I've got complete confidence in Mater. If he says you're good enough, that's good enough for me. Oh, it ain't what I says. It's what the Tomator Fancy Driving Challenge says. What you doing, napping? Wake up! You gotta drive, buddy! Stay to my buddy Sheriff. Mater says you can drive. Well, I'll be the judge of that. Let's see your driving skills, friend. Come on, buddy. Get a move on. I want to see you drive. You just try to catch me. You've got some big 
hubcaps to fill, my friend, but I hear you're up to it. Okay, rookie, show me what you got. You sure? I've seen some pretty good drivers in my day, and you definitely got the tip, kid. Mater's right. That was some of the best driving I've ever seen. You were going to be a great addition to my team. Indeed. I was observing the whole time. That was a most impressive display. This is Holly. She's my girlfriend. Our friend here would make an excellent racer, but an even better spy. And we have a mission that's perfect for your speed and talents. That is, if Lightning doesn't mind waiting. Of course he can wait. Can't you, Lightning? Well, who am I to interfere with British intelligence? You're gonna be a great racer. I just noted. it. Some real good drive. I know you was gonna impress Press everybody, everybody but, but this is better than axle grease with transmission fluid on top. I'm proud of you, buddy. That was more fun than a barrel of greasy lug nuts. I'll play cars with you anytime. Just come and find me. You feel like pretending something new? Cause I hear some kids got a great idea for you. You're quite the cars enthusiast. Fancy another go around, eh? Brilliant. I shall play Holly Shiftwell, British Intelligence. And our mission takes us to Tokyo, where someone has planted a bomb somewhere on the course of the Tokyo Grand Prix. I have a bomb detector, and you're carrying a new device that can disarm the bomb, but it only works at very short range. So you and I have to sweep the course, find, find the bomb, and get close enough to deactivate it before it explodes. That's the signal. It must be somewhere nearby. Francesco Bernoulli? Off of the course, friends of Lightning McQueen. I have a race to prepare for. 
It's Francesco. He's carrying the bomb. And he doesn't even know. You've got to catch him and deactivate it. Just get close to Francesco and disable the bomb. He'll never be the wiser. No time for skylarking. You must catch up to Francesco and disarm that bomb. the view of his rear bumper, because that's all you're gonna see. for messing about. We've got to deactivate that bomb on Francesco. Francesco feels the bad. Francesco. We had no choice. Someone sabotaged you with an explosive device. But you're safe now. Ridiculous! Francesco is not so easily fooled. You are trying to get into my head, friends of Lightning McQueen, but it will never work. I don't know why not. It sounds like there's plenty of room in there. I'll get our technicians to work analyzing this device immediately. As for you, you did your job brilliantly. No one ever even suspected a crisis.
HQ will be so pleased to hear of your success. Well, well done. done. Let me know if you're ever game for more adventures in the spy car trade. Cheers to then. Up for a new challenge? I hear someone's come up with a lovely new idea for you. Somebody stuck on Francesco? Well, now there's a whole convoy of trucks full of those bombs traveling through Porto Corsa. Finn McMissile, British intelligence. And if we can get near enough to the, the convoy, con we can suss out who's behind those bombs. Discretion is vital. We'll keep a low profile and see how close we can get. Ready? Let's go. This mission calls for the utmost discretion. Don't let them see you following. Stay close to that convoy. We can't lose it. We've been spotted, they'll try to lose us. It's our job to make sure they don't. Are you having mechanical problems?
everyone all right in there, Professor? No thanks to you, McMissile. No thanks required, mate. All in a day's work. Nicely done, my friend. Very impressive, impressive indeed. indeed. That's the sort of performance that earns medals and knighthoods. If you follow my meat, it's been a privilege working with you. Hope we can do it again sometime. You know how to find me. Nice. You met all three of the biggest Cars fans. Awesome. Those guys are really imaginative. So keep checking in with them. They're always coming up with new ideas and things. Hey, I'm Jeffrey. I was hoping you'd come over. I'm guessing you like up. Me too. I especially like Russell, because I want to be an explorer when I grow up. What if Charles Muntz knew Kevin had baby birds? And he kidnapped him in his dirigible and flew off. And then Kevin jumps on Mr. Fredrickson's house to say we need to use it to save them. Except the wind blows the house away. It's floating down over the river. But We're going to have to go rafting to get, get to the, the house and save Kevin's babies. training? Cause I will. If you keep this up, you're gonna be done in no time. We have to get Mr. Fredrickson's house to force too late. Show you how to survive in the wilderness? Hey, a zipline! I read about those in my wilderness explorer handbook.
better off if I do that and you handle the important stuff. Don't forget to catch Mr. Fredrickson's house. That was the coolest thing I've seen all day. Don't worry, I've been training for this for weeks. Save Mr. Fredrickson's house. A wilderness explorer never gives up. Babies. Wow, you're a great explorer. You know that? You can explore with me anytime. Adventure is out there. Wow! You have other kids coming up with new adventure ideas for you and everything. I gotta hang out with you more. I hear you're pretty good at exploring the jungle. You want to play some up? Adventure is out there, right? Okay, I'm going to be Doug. Don't laugh. Doug is awesome. Squirrel. And we've flown Mr. Fredrickson's house to the dirigible to save Kevin's babies for months. And then we sneak aboard, and we're I following Kevin to the ship. Work. She can oh. smell them. She's going to lead us right to them. But Kevin's babies are all in cages. cages. She cannot get them open. We will help her. Do not worry, Kevin's baby. We will save you and your brothers Extra and sisters for the dog who loves me. If you see a way to open the cage, my boss cannot do it. That's the thieves, and bring them to me. Hi, I have just met you and I love you. Jump, bing jump, bing jump, bing jump, bing jump, bing jump, bing jump, bing. You are good and Remember smart that? and smell the nice. You are weak. You are strong. I will not accept failure. We'll have to grab that rope and slide now. The humans are not to leave this ship. Do you understand? Surround! They must not escape! 
I have never seen a bacon in the wild. Have you? Let us hurry and save the bird's bacon. It was rightfully mine. They must be kept inside. That's a command. Be so happy right now. I am so happy for you. All you humans astonish us. Hi there. <laughs> you help me fetch the baby birds? Thank you. Thank you very much. I'm sure going to be climbing soon. I think we should celebrate with a treat. Do you have bacon? You will do this next time. I know this because I am a dog. I love jumping, especially when I can jump on squirrels. Are there squirrels? Yes, you are doing very well. Very, very well. sometime, okay? Don't forget, adventure is out there. A new adventure is out there. At least that's what one of the other kids told me. Look around. They shouldn't be hard to find. I'm Asher, by the way. Mr. Fredrickson's so funny. He reminds me of my grandpa. So, you landed the house safely with Kevin and her baby birds, right? Except, guess what? Munson's <laughs> dirigible <laughs> followed it down into you the canyon. Win. The <laughs> dirigible swoops down and snags the balloons. It drags the house back up into the air. Uh-oh. Kevin! The babies! We gotta catch that house! Could we please speed things along here? The dirigible is almost gone. When this is over, I'm gonna recommend you for some kind of award. You'll never see that bird again, you hear me? We'll get there a lot faster if we use this zip line thing. Oh, brother. Looks like we're gonna have to climb that thing. You're not getting that house back. You hear me? <laughs> you can't possibly win! <laughs> Oh, 
sliding. Finally, something I can. Hey, you're lucky. I just finished my back here. Master will be very pleased. And perhaps give me a treat. You still let us see how you like this. I'll hunt you to the edge of the earth. Let's I've never seen anything like what you just did. You're ruining my life's work, you sorry excuses for dogs. Hurry! The dirigible is gonna leave the canyon. <laughs> Easy, Kevin. They're safe now. That bird and those babies. That bird and her babies are mine. I 
Yeah, thanks. thanks. Without you, we never have saved Kevin's babies. Or our house. Boy, I can't remember the last time I had so much fun. Come play up with me anytime you want. Adventure will be right here. Cool, you've met all three of the biggest up fans. Don't be a stranger to them though. They have lots more cool ideas to explore. That was the single most incredible thing I have ever seen in my entire life. True. Hey, I'm Tommy. You like Toy Story? Well, let me tell you, if you do, you're gonna love this place. Let's play some Toy Story Pretend. I'm always Sheriff Woody. And you can be your own toy. Now picture this. We're at Sunnyside Daycare, and Bonnie's real excited because her grandma's coming for a visit. Bonnie wants to show her that she's been taking good care of the family toy Granny gave her. Mr. Pricklepants! But Mr. Pricklepants fell out of Bonnie's backpack. What? Which means we gotta get him out, out of Sunnyside, Sunnyside and, and into, into the, the car before Bonnie and her mom leave for the airport to pick up Grandma. We need a plan to get you over that gate. Oh. Well... Perhaps if we procured a battery... You're a genius! You're going to be a legend around here in no time. Come on, partner. Mr. Pricklepants is counting on us. I'm at the airport in just a few minutes. Keep up the good work, partner. You must help them get to Bonnie before she and her mother depart. Get jumping! Hey, this will be fun, right? Let me see you slide. <laughs> you know what you are? You know you're my favorite deputy. Now hold on, we can figure this out. No batteries, no winch. No winch, no Mr. Prickle Pants. Not to alarm you, but Bonnie and her mom are leaving! Whoa, 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 take it easy, settle down. I'm right here, partner. Aren't you excited? We're gonna pick up Grandma at the airport in just a few minutes. Almost there! Listen here. I have to get to that car. If I'm not there when Grandma arrives, Bonnie will be devastated. No! We can't drag our boots now! You can't tell me there aren't any batteries in this whole place! It's a daycare! <laughs> Whoa! 
Wow. Slide, partner, slide. We really need to think outside the toy box. You know what they say, creative problems require creative solutions. You are really good, you know that? Oh, well, looks like we're gonna have to climb. Keep going. Now this is what I call cutting to the chase. You know, I really don't get to drive enough. Well, will you look at that? Come on, come on! <laughs> Goodness, Sheriff. Now what do we do? We hold on. No matter what, do not let go. Next stop, the airport. We hung in there and saved Mr. Pricklepants. Now I call that teamwork. Great teamwork, teamwork, everybody. That was awesome, partner. I play Toy Story with you anytime. Just come back if you want to play some more. Hey, you got a fan who wants to try out a new idea for an adventure with you. I'm about to blast off on a new Toy Story mission. Ready? I'm Buzz Lightyear! Let's pretend we're riding on the back of Bonnie's mom's car. Then when we get to the airport, Al is there from the toy bar. He's on his way to a toy museum in Japan. And he sees this awesome, one-of-a-kind, and really valuable hedgehog toy. So he grabs Mr. Pricklepants, puts him in his bag, and sends them back to the airplane. Now we gotta find Mr. Mr. Pricklepants Prickle Pants before they put him on that plane to Japan. To L's suitcase and beyond! <laughs> so we have to hurry. We're running out of time to save our friend. Off you go, down the slide. The finish line is in sight.
may not be flying, but it is sliding with style. Bonnie's room is terrific. I think it's been a smooth and orderly transition for everyone. How can I be of service? The secret to sliding is to not hold on. Move out! We can't let Al take Mr. Pricklepants to Japan. Uncle to Japan? Day, I know nothing of the language, the customers. This is your oh, captain please. speaking. Save me. And we'd like to welcome you aboard Far East Flight A113 non-stop service to Tokyo Narita. This is your captain again. Let's get climbing. It looks like we're hitting some turbulence, so let's we're get turn climbing. On the fasten seatbelt sign for the next few minutes. Mr. Pricklepants can't go to Japan. So it's up to us to make sure that doesn't happen. One Space Ranger reporting for duty. Enjoy the slide. It's better than flying. It's falling with style. say, I believe it. We did it! All toys are safe and accounted for. We made it just in time, and all thanks to you. on a high note, my friend. You, my friend, are great, great in a crisis. crisis. And anytime you want to play Toy Story again, just come find me. What you need is a new mission. One of the kids has one for you, I think.
Well, looky who the cat dragged in. I've heard all about you. Let's play us some Toy Story. Woohoo! Now I'll be Jesse. What if Bonnie's grandma missed her flight? So there's still a chance to get home to Bonnie before grandma gets there. And all those toys are flying on our kites. But the wind grabs Mr. Pricklepants and pulls them right over the garbage dump. We gotta land safely. Get out and get back to Bonnie's house before Grandma arrives. Hang on, Mr. Pricklepants. We're coming for you. I'm not feeling so good. Can we get out of here and quick? Watching you is downright inspiring. Deliver me from this horrid place. And all our garbage bays of lighted toys. The way to dusty death. Out. Out, brief candle. Garbage bays of lighted toys. The way to dusty death. Out. Out with candle. I don't want to scare you, 
Oh, what a rogue and peasant toy am I. Is it not monstrous that this conveyor here... I did. How's my girl? Great! And I have somebody in my room who's gonna be extra happy to see you! Just in the nick of time! And we sure couldn't have done it without you! It's your first rodeo, is it, partner? Well, I sure would like to play again sometime. Just come find me. Happy trails! Way to go! You made friends with all three of the biggest Toy Story fans. Don't think you're finished with them, though. They have plenty more to show you. Superheroes? I do. The Incredibles is my favorite. You want to be a super with me? I'll be Violet, because it would be super cool to turn invisible. What if we were on Nomanison Island with Mirage? Now that Syndrome's gone, we have to check to make sure the island's safe. But one Omnidroid is still active. It kidnaps Mirage and takes her inside the volcano base. We've got to save Mirage from the Omnidroid. We've got to save Mirage from the Omnidroid. Let me go, you horrid machine. I think we have to open that door. So I bet we each need to stand on one of those activators. Hurry, come on. Should I call Mirage and tell her we're going to be late? I'm sure the Omnidroid won't mind. Is it okay if I pick up a few tips from you? I think you've made excellent progress today. Wow, I'm definitely glad we're friends.
Looks like we're gonna have to climb. Hurry! It's Omni Droid! Oh, I know how this works. We jump up, grab the line, and then slide. Maybe we should try throwing something. How do you think Mirage would feel if she saw us wasting time like this? Aren't tropical islands supposed to be all fun and beaches and stuff? Droid is going down. You hear me, robot? Wow, with skills like that, you really are a super. This is very cool. I don't even need a learner's permit. Hey, maybe I should be taking pictures. realized I forgot to finish my chemistry homework. I'd Somebody love to stay here all day, me. but I don't think Mirage would appreciate it. Help! I need help! Quickly! Please! I hope Mirage is okay. That Omnidroid better not hurt her. Somebody help! Please! Nicely done. Did I mention I'm not crazy about heights? I don't know about all this free fall stuff. It's not like I can fly. That was pretty cool. because it is definitely working. I was in good hands. You two truly are incredible. Well, that's what the I stands for. But I couldn't have done it without my new friend. Mirage! That was 
pretty incredible. We make a super duper team. Wow, that was awesome. Let me know if you want to play again, okay? Because I'll be a super with you anytime. If you're not busy, I heard this kid say they had a cool new idea for you. Fan. Well, I'm just like Dash. When I was little, they used to call me Turbo. So you guys saved Mirage, right? Cool, but what if we find out that wasn't the last Omnidroid? That the whole Omnidroid factory is back online. And a new Omnidroid 9000 is working. It's following its original programming to destroy the city by creating an army of Omnidroids. So we sneak into the base, and, and activate the auto destruct, destruct sequence, sequence to destroy the factory. Auto destruct sequence activated. And you now we have to get off the island before everything explodes and sets off the volcano. Which would be so cool. I mean, it would be bad. Really bad. Come on. Hurry, we're running out of time. I'm ready, you boy. Get out of your face. Whoa, now. how did you do that? Explosion. Auto destruct sequence complete in three, two, one, zero.
because I forgot to run. So can we go, please? Woohoo! Let's go sliding! Sweet! This family. Let's play Incredibles again sometime soon, okay? See ya. Oh yeah, this kid said they had a cool idea for a new adventure. Go find him. Ready to be a super? Okay, I'm Mr. Incredible. And here's what's happening. We destroyed all the Omnidroids, except one. And it's headed straight for Metroville. The only thing standing between, between it, it and the city is us. to slide. Nice work. You're really going places. Today's garbage day. Did I take the cans out? We can't let this thing do any more damage. We have to take we better it better get going if we're gonna stop that robot. That Omnidroid is gonna rip this town apart if we don't do something. before it levels the whole city! Well, that's how a real super does it. Terrific! Great! I've been feeling like a workout. Time to slide. Time to slide. Not bad. Have you thought about diversifying? You'd be really marketable. right now.
listening. The mission is to stop the robot and make sure out. nobody dies. Well, somebody ought to start a gym for soup. I can't keep working out of the rail yard. I knew you could do it. Omnidroid before it levels the whole city! The Omnidroid was programmed to destroy this city and it's our job to stop it. Time to slide. Time to slide. Nice work. You're really going places. Time. Let's get in there and save the city. down that robot once and for all. We can't let this thing do any more damage. We have to take it out. Hey, you know what? Just might be my hero. We gotta stop that Omnijoy before it tears this city to pieces. Great job. This is ridiculous. We have to stop that Omnidroid now. We can't let this thing do any more damage. We have to take it out. I like your style, kid. I'm just glad everybody's safe. Feels pretty good to save an entire city, huh? And you! You, you were something else. else! Hey, how fast do you think you were going? Boy, you had some great moves! That was totally wicked! We gotta do that again sometime, okay? Don't forget! Awesome! You're friends with all three of the biggest Incredibles fans. But you're not finished with Incredibles. Those guys have so many ideas left to show you. Inspector as proof. 
And the health inspector put Twitch in a jar. We've got to get that jar to Lee Wee so he can let Twitch out. That way he can stall Skinner and the health inspector while we get the rats out of Custos. Gotta work fast. First, we need to get rid of these pigeons. Hey, I bet that water will scare them off. It's foolproof. Come on. Try not to be nervous, Twitch. Or less nervous, anyway. Nice. I cannot feel my leg. I don't want to rush you, but I'm feeling a little lightheaded. <laughs> How long till we get to the cleaning? Jump to the rope and then slide on down. We need to go this way. the brains of the operation. I'm not gonna lie to you, Twitch. You could use some air. Let's go! Really? Okay, that was amazing! Now that's how it's done. You're gonna be great. All you have to do is jump onto the road. Please hurry! I don't know how long I'm gonna be able to breathe in here. You gotta get me to Linguini. Get Twitch to Linguini. He'll take care of the rest. What's the matter, little buddy? You need some help? Health inspector? Oh, thank goodness. Twitch is saved. And we have time to warn the other rats. of Paris again, you come and find me. One of the other children wants to try out a new pretend scenario with you. It's so exciting. I hear you like Ratatouille. Me too. My name's Peter. Okay, I'm gonna be Emil. That's Remy's brother. And you can be your own rat. And what if there's this big rainstorm? The skies over Paris are opening up. Rain's coming down in buckets. It pours through the street and into the sewers. The drain pipes are filling up fast. Pretty soon, the whole sewer's gonna be flooded. And Django, that's her dad. He had a boat loaded up with food and supplies for the rat colony for just such an emergency. We, we, we gotta get out of here. This whole place is gonna be underwater any second. Hold on, son. 
First, we got to get the boat back safe to the colony. I need you to pull those handles and open the sluice gates along the way, or we're going to be trapped. It's a boat, not a submarine. Now go! Garbage was good enough for my dad, it was good enough for his dad, and well, I like it too. We're heroes! I can't believe it! Great. We're gonna get wet. We're almost there! I say we get moving before this place fills up. Get a move on. Let's go! Okay, why not? We can't waste time. The water's still pouring in. This calls for a toast. We're going for a little swim. Maybe that thing does something cool, you think? See what happens when you press that button. I'm glad you're here, buddy. Look, a ball! Let me see how long I can balance on it. Oh, maybe we'll get food if you push that button. I tell you, my dad is gonna be so proud! Come on, Chop Chop, move it! Dad's gonna be so proud! Uh, I gotta say, I am not liking this current! Nice work! Dad actually said nice work! This may be the best day of my whole life! Let's 
Listen, anytime you want to play in the sewers again, you just find me. See you later. Somebody was looking for you. They got a whole new idea for an adventure. I heard all about you. I'm Jack. I was just about to play some more Ratatouille. Okay, what if we're in the kitchen at Gusto's and Linguini got the rats out before the health inspector came? But now, Skinner's madder than ever. And he knows that Anton Ego, the famous food critic, is at Gusto's tonight because he loves Remy's Ratatouille. And Skinner wants to ruin the Ratatouille. And then Ego will change his mind and give Gusto's a bad review and they'll have to shut down forever. It's Skinner. He's coming to the kitchen. He's going to ruin Remy's cooking. We, we have, have to, to stop, stop him. To the kitchen. At this rate, we won't have anything left to cook with. This may be our finest moment. Great job. Chop, rodents, chop, chop! Out of my restaurant! You what can me? I do for you? You're not setting one dirty little claw in my kitchen! Skinner, no! Hey, that does it. We need to go put a stop to this insanity. Get back to the stools where you belong! Throw that thing over there. What's the worst that can happen? Only oh, there was something you could throw. Rats in the kitchen! Has the whole world You are the master, my friend! Get back to the soil where you belong! Around. Could be something you could throw that at. Skinner's out of control! We have to stop him! Rats in the kitchen! Has the whole world Skinner's gone in! I need a soup for Mr. Ego! Slide, 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 that's good. Out of my way, chef! You don't want... Keep it up! Not bad at all! You're destroying everything I've worked for! There you go, slide a little more. Did I? This is a restaurant, not a pet shop! Get back to the sewers where you belong! Climb! Like your life depends Run on it! Because it might! Has the whole world gone mad? Get back to the sewers where you belong! What's in the kitchen? Has the whole world gone mad? Almost truffle season. There's just gotta be something great I can do with truffles. Get back to the sewers where you stop, belong. Skinner, pronto. Get back to the famine. kitchen. Has the whole world gone mad? This is 
is a restaurant, not a pet shop. You make a great team. What in the kitchen has the whole world got no famine? Yeah. Get back to the sewers where you belong. Uh, Mr. Ego wants the ratatouille. That's it. Slide into the turn. A professional's what you needed, and here I am. At this rate, we won't have anything left to cook with. Out of my restaurant. Rats rule. Oh, Mr. Ego is getting impatient. If Mr. Ego doesn't get his food, he's going to... I'll admit it, I am impressed. Code, you disgusting rodents! Get back to the sewers where you belong! Voila! Your ratatouille, Mr. Eagle. What's in the kitchen? Bon appetit. Has the whole world gone mad? This Nothing is a like a good climb. What can I do for you? Monsieur Ingo, it's... it's bold, that's it! That's too going far enough! Has we have to stop Skinner! Wait! Don't eat it! Throw it's that thing that over is. there! I mean, what's the worst that could happen? That was nothing! A minor setback! Get too famine! Ingo. Only there was something you could oh, throw. This is a restaurant, not a pet shop. Get to famine! Maniac! This has to end! Wait, don't eat it! It's Throw poison, it. I tell you! Poison! That's what I'm talking about! Team one, tie that chef up and get him in the fridge! Team two, get this mess cleaned up! You, my friend, are one cool rat under pressure. In my kitchen, anytime. I love this park. I think I could live here. Do they let people do that? Nice going! You met all three of the biggest Ratatouille fans. They're not done yet, though. They still have a lot of cool ideas and stuff to share with you. Follow me. Just keep swimming. Just keep swimming.
look at that. Nice going! You met all three of the biggest Ratatouille fans. They're not done yet, though. They still have a lot of cool ideas and stuff to share with you.
right, gang. Wow, you've met every kid in this park. That's fantastic. You're not out of fun stuff to do, though. There's plenty more left out there. Just go ask them.